I've got a delicious chestnut and porcini mushroom stuffing to show you. Now, for the porcinis themselves, I've got a carton of dried porcini. They're going to go into a heat-proof bowl. I'm going to cover them with boiling water and then set them aside to soak. Now, while that's happening, I'm going to put a little bit of olive oil and a knob of butter into my frying pan. And we're just going to gently soften some sliced leeks. With a little bit of crushed garlic. So that's going to take a few minutes just to soften in. We don't want them to colour, just to get tender. And while that's happening, I'm going to chop the rest of the ingredients. I've got some cooked chestnuts here that I'm going to chop quite roughly. Okay, that's our chestnuts chopped. I'm going to pop them into this large mixing bowl. That's what we're going to use to mix all of the stuffing together. So get those out of the way. Just give those leeks a quick stir so the leeks are softening nicely. I think they just need a minute or two more. So, in here I've got some ciabatta bread that's been torn roughly. I'm just going to take a little bit of that liquid and spoon it over the top of the bread. And just leave it for a moment or two just to absorb the liquid. Pop that there. And I'm going to take out these mushrooms now. And you can keep the rest of the stock for something else, like making a risotto. There's quite a lot of flavour inside the mushrooms themselves, so you need to chop them fairly finely. So, same knife, just... Okay, now I'm going to add these to the bowl too. And let's add those leeks and give them a moment to cool. They're really nice and tender now. Now, for our last bit of chopping, I've got some parsley. I'm just going to nip off those stalks and then again a bit of rough chopping. So, let's add the parsley to the bowl. along with that soaked bread. Some grated parmesan. And I'm going to mix this together first before I add the egg, just to make sure everything gets blended evenly. OK, let's get that egg in, and the egg is going to hold it all together. I've got a baking dish here, it's been lightly buttered and it's one of those sort of dishes that you can cook it in and you can serve it in at the table too. So you just spoon the stuffing in, just pat it down and spread it out a little bit so it cooks evenly. And now it just needs 20 minutes in the oven so it gets all crusty and golden brown. So there's my lovely stuffing. Just pop it on the table and let everyone help themselves. <laughs>